Hello. Thank you for watching this brief tutorial for App Manager Analytics. To access the Analytics platform, first log in to App Manager. Once inside App Manager, you'll have access to a number of different application management tools, such as Base Manager, Pipe View, and the Analytics platform. To access the Analytics platform, simply select the icon. The Analytics platform is going to provide you with access to real-time data, diagnostic information, and historical data for your company, for a site, for a controller, and for all devices connected to a controller. You'll have access to interactive charts and graphs, as well as printable PDF reports. Once you open Analytics Platform, it's going to start you at the company level, and you can use this indicator button to open a slide-out menu that's going to give you real-time flow data, as well as historical rate and usage data for your entire company. The data presented at this point is a compiled data point of every site and every controller within your company portfolio that has flow sensing technology. You can access the data with the drill down interactive charts or through the download PDF report functionality. This will generate a report for your entire company showing you the date as well as the level of detailed information you wish to specify. You can change that by drilling down into individual months or by specifying a specific date range located here in the toolbar. From the company level, you can drill down into individual sites that make up your company. And at each of the sites, you can access all of the compiled flow data for every controller on that individual site. Here we give you general information, real-time flow information, historical rate and usage, where we can also drill down into tighter resolution for greater specificity over what happened to your site and when. From here, you can generate a report that you can share with key stakeholders to ensure that you're providing them with the information that they need in order to manage their sites effectively. From the site level, you can drill down into an individual controller. The control the controller view will provide you with um, context for so you know which controller you're looking at at which site, any live active messages related to that controller, real-time flow data at that moment in time for the controller, historical flow data, real-time two-wire diagnostic data for the two-wire path active at that controller, providing you with two-wire voltage, two-wire current, and the temperature of the electronics inside the controller enclosure at that moment in time. Each of these graphs individually can be exported, or you can also drill down into the real time or into the historical data at the drill down interactive graphs. At the controller level, you can also generate a PDF report that you can email and share with any critical team members, providing them with context and information that they may need to make educated decisions on how to manage their sites more effectively. From the controller, you can drill down into all of the devices attached to that specific controller. And this could include a zone, flow meter, moisture sensors, but for other controllers, it could also include pressure sensors, event switches, air temperature sensors, pump start relays, and more. At the zone level, you can select the zone and pull up and access real-time information pertinent to that specific zone in the two-wire path, whether it's active or not, its most recent run times and for how long, historical run times based off of date and duration, real-time flow data for that moment in time estimated at that point in the two-hour path and in the hydraulic structure, historical rate and usage graph for that zone, and then the real-time two-wire diagnostic information for what's happening in that zone in that moment of time, as well as that individual zone's two-wire history over time that you can drill down into for greater clarity over that device's lifespan on the two-wire path. You can also generate individual reports for each individual zone based off of context, 
so you can provide for your team for more information to better manage the site and what's happening. You can also access moisture by opening the moisture sensor slide out tab and this will provide you with real-time moisture and temperature data and historical moisture and temperature data that you can drill down into and with all the graphs within the analytics platform you can get down into single minute resolution of your data so you can get very specific information for what's happening and when it happened and at what point in time. For best results with the analytics platform, we strongly encourage you to update your Base Station 3200 firmware to version 17.9 or newer in order, to, in order to have access to the most reliable and up-to-date data that the controller is able to access from the two-wire path and from the devices it's connected to. That concludes our tutorial today for analytics. Thank you, and please reach out to us if you have any questions.